Before I get into these tweets, let me go ahead and bring you guys up to speed. So basically, your girl Trina today, June 3rd of 2020, was on 99 Jams with the Trick and Trina show. She was talking to Trick Daddy about the protests and whatever else is going on in America right now. Basically, she was saying in so many words like, look, these protesters are out here acting like animals. You know, they're showing their natural behinds. They're being ridiculous. She doesn't support it. They're tearing up the city, her city of Miami, uh, among other cities. You know, they they done destroyed her friend's business, and her friend is not some rich celebrity or anything like that. Friend got a kid to take care of, and even though her business is insured, it's still not right. And you know, people were doing this allegedly over my man George Floyd, but her brother, Trina's brother, lost his life, and all lives basically basically matter and should be looked at as being equal. It doesn't matter whether or not a cop who swore to serve and protect committed a crime or a citizen at the end of the day a life is a life and that's just just it in the story she's not even concerned with the fact that citizens don't swear to serve and protect they don't take that oath she's acting like it's equivalent for a cop who doesn't get charged for their crime to do something as it is for a civilian who committed the same crime and got charged so you know she's she was really acting really really dumb so then she went and put out a series of tweets. And I'm going to read a tweet from May 28th first. Because I'm going to point something out to you. She said, I'm in no rush to go back outside. So in other words, the quarantine is not bothering her. Not like that. Anyway, then she posted a song called Be Heard by Money Mark Digla. And the song is in so many words. You could say like a, a song about justice and be basically being against what went on with my man George Floyd. So I think that's just so funny that she posted this song and then she went on to say, don't come on my page with y'all BS because I got time today. Some of y'all are plain effing ignorant and nobody, nobody do will help period. And nobody, nobody do will help you. Anyways, I'm at work and I'm mother blinking ready. The problem with some of y'all, y'all don't want to hear the truth. Well, y'all can be mad. Y'all should put that anger and frustration into doing something better instead of talking crap about people. Shout out to the shade room because they caught the exchange between Trina and Masika. But also Trina said, this isn't about me. I've done and I'm doing my part. So leave me the blank alone. What are you doing? Yeah. What are you doing? My point exactly. In other words, y'all ain't doing nothing. So my baby Masika Kalisha said, Kaya. Beloved, please come drag this coon Trina back to the swamp before I get her. The sun ain't even come up yet, and the coon of the day award goes to Trina. So Trina said, Masika Kalisha, drag who, B? Because I'm the one. And your Twitter thug A will get beat the F down. What's good, ho? B, keep my name out your mouth. So Masika Kalisha replied, You better be glad someone knows your name, you dusty effing coon. I used to sneak to listen to you, clown. You are a joke. I am ashamed of you. You are a blinking embarrassment to your blinking race. How blinking dare you? I'm going to say whatever the F I want. Try me, old hoe. I got time today. Now, we know Trina's not old. But anyway, somebody said, hashtag, I got time today. And Masika said, I'm up now. Clock the F in. Woke, eating mother blinking popcorn. Look at my watch type of time. So somebody else said, sign this petition to have Trina removed from TNT Morning Show. They're trying to get the woman fired. Masika said, hey, y'all. <laughs> Help me keep this old hag's name out my mouth per her final wishes. Final. Woo. So Trina said, first of all, bun AB. She meant to say bum AB. Find out who your baby daddy really is. Masika. And you don't know what the F you are, are talking about. You think you can come up here and talk crap to me? You scumbag. You can't. How I'm ready and I'm not the one. I guess you mean to say, ho, oh, I'm ready. But Sika, first of all, that video was edited to what I said. Second of all, if you don't know the exact facts, shut the F up. If you want answers for clarification, say that. But you will not think you can come up here and talk crap about me because you can't. Masika, I will address the people. But you dumb AB, I don't owe you crap. You can eat a duck diet bag. The F is wrong with you, Masika. And by the way, dumb hoe, if you was fully listening to my music, you wouldn't have grown to be a dumb hoe. <laughs> so Masika says, pull up. 
with some scared looking emojis and a hand over the mouth emoji. Okay, eyes are coming. Let me book this flight so I can fight your dumb A. Wait, Trina, you're acting like an animal. Don't you dare quote Rihanna, an actual activist who pulls up. Girl, the word clout wasn't even invented when you were relevant. Take your afternoon nap. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Another old reference. Run it, contemplating face emoji. This old A crumb trying to race me barefoot, ill-equipped, out of shape, and unfit, no match. Your poor thumbs just a shaking, trying to think of some something witty to say. The whole world is dragging you. Why are you in love with me? You need attention. Get off my clit and address the millions of people you let down. Woo! And the shade room says, hashtag Trina and hashtag Masika Kalisha has some final words for one another. And they said to view the earlier post, which I already read. Let me go ahead and check right now, see if they posted anything else. No, there's nothing else. So they shut up. Good. Because I'm tired of reading. Listen, y'all. Here's my commentary. So I'm, this is the part where y'all exit because y'all don't care about what I have to say. Um... Masika, that's my little baby. Now, y'all know I love me some Masika. Now, y'all know it. Masika don't F with me, but you know I F with her the long way. You know, that's that's my girl and my idol. And, 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 and you know, that's, that's my dream girl, basically. And, you know, Masika, let me see. Trina, Trina's annoying as hell. Y'all know she gets on my nerves. Been told y'all she should have been canceled a long time ago because I don't like the way that she talks to people. I don't, like, I don't like the way that she treats people. She has this superiority complex. She's very, she's extremely arrogant. You know, she acts like somebody who has status, money, wealth, fame, resources. And then she looks at other people like, I'm a queen and you're a freaking peasant, you plebeian fool, you trash. You know, like she looks at people like as if she's literally sitting on a throne and she's looking down at everybody else who's just a bunch of court jesters who are there to entertain her. And I think that that arrogance is just downright disgusting. I, it's, it's appalling to me personally. I, I, I just can't. I, I don't like it. And I feel like she's not talented enough to be that arrogant. Like, you know who's talented enough to be that arrogant? Little Kim. Now, Little Kim is arguably the greatest female rapper ever, right? Uh, also, you know what? To some degree, Nicki Minaj. I mean, because of her success, I can understand. Nikki's not as talented as Kim was in her prime. However, I can understand how she could be full of herself considering the fact that she raised the bar for her rap, not just female rap. The fact that she, you know, has made so many classics and so many hits and whatnot. And she's a veteran at this point and low key a legend. You know what I mean? Like, like she did some really legendary stuff. I know she took a lot of Kim's swag. She took a lot of her style and everything. But I can understand your girl Nicki Minaj, who another person I don't like. I don't, I don't F with Nicki, but. I can understand how Nikki could be cocky, it, you know, and, and, and have her chest, you know, uh, you know, up high and poked out like huh, I'm Queen Nikki. Don't you dare think you could touch this crown. I can understand to some degree why or how she could end up being arrogant. Same thing with Lauren Hill because of the immense talent and versatility that she has. And the fact that El Bookie was fine as hell back in the day or Little Kim who... Little Kim was any, anyway. I ain't gonna say how fine Little Kim was back in there. I, I ain't even gotta get into that. Might have to make a lotion tails video and explain something to y'all. But anyway, I can understand how Kim, being as tight as she was way back when she first started, I can understand her being arrogant. But what has Trina accomplished as a female rapper? She's barely a one or two hit wonder. Trick carried her. If it wasn't for Trick Daddy, we would have never heard her no daggone Trina. She would have been some local Miami. You know who Trina would have been if she did not meet Trick Daddy? She would have been like Jackie O or somebody like that. She wouldn't even have been Tiffany Fox or Foxy Brown. She would have been like, no, not even Jackie O. She would have been Jackie Q. You know what I mean? Like she would have been like some, some female rapper we never heard of before. And not somebody who didn't really make it but deserved to make it like a Nitty Scott or a Ciroc. Or uh, Nairobi Salah, or somebody like like that, a CEO segment, somebody like that who's talented, but for whatever reason didn't blow the way that she deserved to. Not even somebody like that that was slept on. Trina would be the corny female rapper that a couple of people knew the name of and would laugh when they mentioned it. <laughs> remember that Trina chick from back in the day with the high bitch voice? You don't know me. Remember, remember that heifer? Like that's that's what she would be. She would be like somebody that we just laughed about when we discussed she wouldn't be anybody that we took seriously in this thing called hip-hop and f y'all to y'all that are hearing these weird sounds in the background that's this stupid chair that i got y'all know how i got that new chair a couple months ago and that thing just makes crazy noises so don't get on me about that in the comment section i'm not insecure about it i just know how y'all are 
But shoot, I paid enough for it, and I, and I ain't getting rid of it. And I sat my behind up in this chair, naked and everything. Right there on Amino Butterflies Instagram, but that ain't none of y'all business. Anyways, uh, let me know what y'all think about it in the comment section. Whose side do you want, Trina or Masika Kalisha's? Of course, I'm on Masika Kalisha's side. I done spent too much money on lotion visiting Masika's Instagram. Low-key, I've been on Trina's, you know, Instagram rapping hand movement too, but uh, Masika, I, I, don't, I give Masika two empty bottles of lotion because she clowned Trina. She got Trina in her feelings. You're going to basically say that she doesn't even know who her baby daddy is, but yet at the same token, her child has nothing to do with this shout to Kari Barbie. Baby genius, she has her own business already, Kari Barbie Beauty. Make sure y'all buy some products and support the family business. I mean business. Shout out to them. You know, why are you bringing up her kid and Fetty and everything? What? That's just... You know, once again, low blows. Remember, she brought up Nikki Natural's kids. Didn't she call them dirty kids or something like that? Trina is trashy. She doesn't know how to act. She doesn't know how to treat people. And, you know, and, and I mean, on a serious note, I know that she lost her mother. And I feel very bad about that, terrible about that. And But on the funny side, I mean, you know, her career as a female rapper is basically over. And she had to go on reality TV and do a radio show. She had to do a podcast or whatever that is where Trick is once again carrying her on the show as well as on the radio show. He's carrying her on TV as well on radio because it's really the Trick Daddy show and she's basically under his wing and she never really had a chance to really truly have a solo career because her rap music sucked. Come on, long hair, red bottom, step, step. Isn't that how the song goes? It's like, you gotta be kidding me. The chick has no talent. She's not really a rapper. She's just a clown who happens to rap. But anyways, this is all my opinion. Let me know what y'all think about it in the comment section. Let me know you listen all the way into the end of this video. The secret password to say in the comment section is canceled again. Listen, y'all, I told y'all before that she was canceled months ago. Remember, I've been on Trina's behind. I think maybe before Kaya, maybe not. But I, that's what I can't wait for. I don't even mess with Kaya. I don't even like Kaya. But when she roasted Trina recently, I, I was like snot dripping down on my lip laughing. Like I was like crying like that. She roasted her so bad. She was talking about how Trina's kitty cat is basically a wasteland, all types of stuff. And it, oh, it was terrible. Oh, my Lord. I haven't heard a verbal lashing like that in a minute. Kaya should have made a record with them punchlines. They need to bring Kaya, Geisha 305, Cat Stacks, and Jay De Niro. I love a hip-hop Miami and of course bring the real star of the show, my baby Veronica Vega. They need to bring her back because she was the only reason why I watched. But anyways, let me know what you think about it below. Alright, y'all. <laughs> Magal. And make sure y'all buy Veronica Vega's new music. Make sure y'all support Kari Barbie Beauty and Masika's new music. Because, you know, she stays in the studio. She was in the studio again recently. So make sure y'all support. Alright, y'all. Magal. And subscribe to their YouTubes. Click the subscribe button right now for more Meat Magazine. Click the notification bell. All notifications. Click the thumbs up button on this video. Post the comment below the video in the comment section. Be sure to subscribe to all the Meat Magazine channels for more videos. The links to my other channels are in the description box.